good morning dear students today we are going to solve the exercise 4.1 how many tangents can a circle have you know infinite number of tangents can be drawn okay infinite answer infinite tangents okay now in second main fill in the blanks a tangent to a circle intersects it in dash points only one point only one point a tangent to a circle intersects it in only one point second one a line intersecting a circle in two points is called second second third one a circle can have dash parallel tangents at the most that is infinite infinite parallel tangents at the most fourth one the common point of a tangent to a circle is called point of contact point of contact understood okay now let us come to know third main one sum is there a tangent pq at a point p of a circle of radius 5 cm meets a line through the center o at a point q so that oq is equal to 12 cm it is given length of pq is equal to you will have four options a b c d let us solve that sum okay so now now i am going to drawing a circle with center o okay so this and this one is the tangent it is p this one is q oq equal to 12 cm it is given and radius 5 cm it is given the angle at the radius and tangents makes that is 90 degree already we know okay according to pythagoras according to pythagoras theorem okay oq square square of the hypotenuse oq square is equal to op square plus pq square oq 12 square op it is 5 square plus pq square tall square it is 144 5 square it is 25 plus pq square transfer this one 144 minus 25 is equal to pq square 144 minus 25 okay you will get 119 is equal to pq square therefore pq square is equal to once again i am going to writing 100 therefore pq is equal to square root of 119 this one is the option okay now draw a circle and two line par lines parallel to a given line such that one is tangent and the other a second to the circle let us draw a circle here we have to draw the one is tangent other one is second both must be parallel to the one to the other for that one i am going to taking the reference this is o okay this is ab i have drawn the it is a no doubt it is a diameter for this line i am going to drawing a one second 
which should be parallel to this one okay x y it is a second now i am going to drawing a tangent which should be parallel to the that is a diameter as well as second this is p q here x y that second is parallel to tangent p q understood okay now let us solve exercise 4.2 okay first sum from a point q the length of tangent to a circle is 24 cm and distance of q from the center is 25 cm the radius of the circle is dash you will have the four options let us solve a circle o is the center of the circle okay this is the tangent is q this one is p o is the center of the circle so length of the tangent from q that is how much that is to a circle is 24 cm p q it is 24 cm it is given okay you have to find the radius and the from the center to the that is the radius that is how much it is 25 this one is given okay how to find the radius of the circle once again according to pythagoras theorem okay oq square square of the hypotenuse because of your writing work. oq square is equal to op square plus pq square okay oq square is equal to okay now how to substitute it it is a 25 square is equal to op how to find pq is equal to 24 bracket square okay it is 625 is equal to op square plus 24 24 za 576 okay 625 minus 576 is equal to op square that is the radius okay now 625 minus 576 that is 49 is equal to op square therefore op is equal to that is a square root of 49 is equal to that is a 7 cm option is this one okay now second one the figure if tp and tq are the tangents to a circle with center o so that angle poq is equal to 110 it is given then you have to find the angle ptq is equal to how much okay so now angle solution angle poq is equal to 110 it is given okay so we know that the sum of the opposite angles of quadrilateral makes 180 degree therefore angle ptq is equal to 180 minus of 110 okay is equal to angle ptq is equal to 180 minus 110 how much will have 70 degree okay 180 minus 110 it is 70 degree because of here angle opposed z to quadrilateral makes 180 degree it is the reason this one is 70 you will have the 70 option okay now let us come to know one more problem if tangent pa pa and pb from a point p to a circle with center o are inclined to each other at angle 80 degree this is 80 degree total angle 
okay then poa is equal to you have to find the poa is equal to how much okay now i am going to join in this line so this line this op bisects the angle apb that means exactly it is a 40 okay so now angle apb is equal to this one is 80 degree it is given okay angle opa opa is equal to 40 degree because of half of the 80 degree half of the apb that's why it is a 40 degree and angle oab 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 it is 90 degree because of by theorem by theorem okay now we want to find the what angle p o a p o a how to find the p o a is equal to 180 minus of 90 this one is 90 this one is 40 180 minus of 90 plus 40 it is 130 therefore 180 minus of 130 that is a 50 degree okay angle p o a is equal to so it is the option understood thank you